It was good. It was great. It was great. You Delicious. Whew. There's a lot of good food up on, on, here, on the I ship. I think I actually popped a button on my vest here. <laughs> Morning, do not watch this on an empty stomach. All right, so I'm Danny. I'm Danny. And we're gonna show you all of the restaurants on the Pacific Explorer. By the way, this is not a paid advertisement for P&O. This was just a question for my last Q&A video that I wanted to make a full video on. And obviously the best part is we get to try the food. Yum! We are at the fabulous Italian restaurant on board the Pacific Explorer, Angelo's. And if you are hungry and you like your food, this is the place to be. I got the pumpkin arancini, basically a rice ball that's fried and cooked with deliciousness and tomato sauce. We have the antipasto, which is Italian cold cut. I myself ordered the veal osobuco with a production of a red wine sauce. And the other Danny has got a wild mushroom risotto, which is one of my favorites, so I kind of recommend it too. Mm, that's good risotto. I got myself some potato gnocchi. And mixed with a little bit of thyme. On Danny's plate, we have the chicken parmigiana with the rustic antique tomato sauce. And uh, I like to try to steal a little piece of him when he's not looking. Now, what's interesting about the dessert here at Angelo's is you don't order it from the menu. No, it's right here. Pistachio ricotta cannoli, vanilla panna All the sweet and good things in here in life that makes you happy. Mm. I might need a moment by myself. Is literally to die for. We're gonna have some delicious Asian food right here on board the Pacific Explorer at the Dragon Lady restaurant. Very wide menu, selection of everything, meats, fish, poultry, vegetarian options. It's a pear and ginger shot. It's kind of to warm up your palate. Cheers. That's yummy. All right, so I got the duck samosas, and then we have the corn and prawn fritters. And this is our waiter show, right? Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday. We got a uh, green curry barramundi. We got slow cooked beef cheeks, rose dumplings, and last but not least, we got some spicy Thai prawns. Give me a bite, give me a bite, give me a bite. That is the tenderest meat I've ever had. Mmm, -hmm. man. Mm. That's really good. Wow. You got a 70% salted caramel chocolate cake. And this has got to be one of my favorite desserts in the entire world. It's an apple caramel cinnamon milkshake. Today, we are at the famous pizza place 400 Grati, uh, an Italian creation that has been collaborated with Pino to create a delicious menu with all the little rustic home style Italian food. So I'm looking forward to it as always because I'm a big pizza lover. What's really fun about these starters is that they have a couple of selections of meats and cheese and you can create your own platter. Choose in three or four weeks to accompany it with this delicious focaccia bread right here. That's a lot of garlic. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we got our pizzas and they smell delicious. I went for the caprese, which has a little bit of rocket, uh, fresh prosciutto ham, and of course my favorite, goat cheese. And Danny opted for the Romana, which got cured leg ham. Oh my god. We have a semi fredo, which is kind of like ice cream that's almost frozen, but it's a little bit lighter, area and fluffer, accompanied with a peanut brittle and a couple of strawberries. Also to accompany that, we got the panna cotta, which is a cream-based jello so to say and the funny thing is it comes with popcorn that's a way to do it that is good whoa flavors flavors bye bye judy bye bye everybody have a fantastic night and we even got a pizza to take away you can keep it but there needs to be at least one piece when i finish work okay if not i'm gonna be very very happy my day was excellent Welcome everybody to The Pantry. This is a wonderful restaurant where you can get all your three main meals of the day, which is breakfast, lunch, and dinner. What we have is six different sections, which includes a Mexican section, Italian, 
Asian, German, American, and my little favorite, the fish and chip section. But also, our seventh section, everybody's favorite, the desserts. So close. Real quick, real easy, in and out, and as always, real delicious. Mm. Perfect. I feel like we should have a little burger. And where do you go for your burgers? Luke's Grill and Bar. Easy menu, very cheap, affordable, and as always, delicious. like this you can't really complain. We have our burgers. I went for the Korean spicy crispy Gangnam style burger. Danny being the cheese lover that is went for the big double cheese. That's the face of pure enjoyment right there. I like this. This is good. Good stuff. How's the food guys? Welcome to the waterfront. Welcome to the waterfront, our main dining room on board the Pacific Explorer. Me and Danny are going to go on another little mandate to see what the menu has to offer. Let's go. They're very friendly here, wouldn't you say, Danny? They're very friendly. I like it. Thank you so much, sir. Thank you. Menu changes every day. They serve breakfast, they serve lunch, they serve dinner. I got the uh, Malaysian noodle soup broth with a vegetable dumpling. This will clear up your sinuses, so if you have a cold, come to the waterfront. But wash your hands, wash your hands, wash your hands. Danny went for the duck with a little bit of assorted vegetables. Okay, enjoy. Thank you, Frankie. Thanks, Frankie. All right, we got our miso glazed salmon right here with bok choy, different pickled vegetables such as brown rice. I went for the Wellington. Now, normally you see a Wellington with beef, but they've opted for the chicken here. All right, dessert time. Favorite part of the meal. I went for the vanilla passion fruit cream puff. Danny went for the strawberry tiramisu. Let's just give it a go, see, what, see what's in there. Oh, it's filled with something yummy. That taste of the brown sugar glazed on the outside with the sweetness of the passion fruit. So delicious. Last but not least on this, we thought we'd end with something more expensive. This is the creme de la creme, the piece de resistance. And I have a classic surf and turf, you have fish, you have big Oh, let's just go. Steaks. Let's just go, I'm hungry. <laughs> Wow, have you seen something more magnificent than this? Uh, I'm a fan of squid, so it's gonna be a test. Oh, so good. I am beyond excited. It smells, it smells delicious. I just wanna get into it. This is amazing. Look at the size of that. I see that just melts in your mouth. It is filled with buttery goodness. This is what's left. Nothing but shell, empty shells, but a very full stomach. But uh, we're still waiting for my favorite part, dessert. It's that size. That's not a normal brownie size. Oh, it's gooey in this. Oh my God, <laughs> look at that. <laughs> This is our New Zealand ice cream, which is famous on board. We're gonna have a little bit of custard on there, vanilla custard, get all of it in there. All right. Wow. Um, I'm, I'm speechless. Um, wow. So that was the food on the Pacific Explorer. Like all the wonderful food. If you're coming on the ship, Definitely tried all the restaurants. Some of them you have to pay for, but most of them are included in are, your fare. Yeah. And thank you, Piano, for giving us this oh, opportunity. Absolutely. And they're very cool. We like them a lot. So how do we sign up? Uh, uh, stay hungry, cruislings. Uh, stay or, hungry. Eat like it's no place on earth. <laughs> Definitely. <laughs> stay full. Stay full. <laughs> Always order dessert. <laughs> Always order dessert. <laughs> when in doubt, <laughs> order dessert. I like that. See you guys. Peace out. And as always, thanks for watching. Know how we ordered seafood? Get it? See? Food? Ah. <laughs> Terrible with those jokes. <laughs> and if you want to help support this channel, just click that subscribe button. And if you want to watch more, start with this one.